Hi there, I'm Dom, a product manager on Google Play. Welcome to the very first episode of Replay, where we'll be recapping the top three recent updates on Google Play for app and game developers. Number one, we've made the review process clearer in the publishing flow. You've told us you don't always know what changes are getting sent to Google Play for review and what changes are getting published immediately. So on the publishing overview page, you'll now see a section called changes ready for a review. When you save a change that needs to be reviewed, you'll see it listed here first. Then when you're ready, you can send it for review at the same time as your other pending changes. You can also remove changes that have already been sent for review. Number two, we've improved a number of app quality metrics that you see in the Play Console. Total crash and ANR rates are now user perceived crash and ANR rates. This helps you prioritize issues that are most visible to users. You'll also now see per device quality thresholds. This reflects the fact that technical quality can vary from device to device. And this will also help users choose the best experience for their device. For games, there's a new frame rate metric called slow sessions. These are sessions lower than the 30 FPS target and sessions lower than the 20 FPS minimum. 20 FPS is the minimum expected for all games. Number three, we started rolling out the Privacy Sandbox beta to a small percentage of eligible Android devices. Privacy Sandbox is our new ads technology that protects user privacy while helping companies and developers build sustainable businesses. The beta introduces APIs that can track user activity across apps and websites, but without identifiers. Now users and developers will get to use Privacy Sandbox in the real world. Follow the link in the description to learn more and participate in the beta. That's it. Those are our top three updates of the year so far. There are links down below with more details. And drop us a comment with what you want to see in these videos in the future. Thanks for watching.